Hannah Franklin, some of your Uh Transgender hate mail, homosexual hate mail, atheist hate mail. Basically, mostly negative comments from usually from YouTube and DeviantArt. And then in response to the comments I made um, against these deviant lifestyles. And a few other things. Um, there's bonuses. Uh, I are more positive. Um, bonuses that are more positive are, um, are pretty negative too. Especially when it comes to Kung Fu, you can be positive or negative. Uh, what's the name? Uh, yeah, uh, different characters, cartoon characters or whatever. Uh, that I want to talk about. You know, fan art, whatever. We'll, we'll see what's on here. Uh, trigger warning words like penis, vagina, uterus, ovaries, testicles, and vulva will be used in these uh, in, in these videos. I am a Bible believing Christian, so I say may take you off. There are people that say they're Christian, but don't believe the Bible. Well, they say may take you off. And it really messes them up. And there are people that say, there are people that say God is evil, which is wrong, or God does not exist, which is wrong, and what they say may take you off. Uh, no word names or icons will be taught, shown or talked about in this video. Uh, uh, talked about in these videos either because uh, that you know, shows off uh, ev you know, ev evidence <laughs> that I'm uh, harassing people. <laughs> so, yeah. Basically, that's how it goes. Uh, yeah, but I will be talking, reading uh, something off screen here. Just, just, just do that. My mouse. Mm, I can show you the mouse mm, at the very least. Mm, I can show you the mouse at the very least. Mm, so yeah, there you go. Uh, we'll continue on here. Now, uh, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Where is she? What did she say? What did she say? What did she say? Oh, yeah. In order to transition, people need to learn everything about me. Mm, yeah. yeah, in some ways, I guess, because they have to examine her to make sure she. Is healthy and it's annoying because mm, it's like yeah you're really healthy a fully healthy female mm, for more than three mm, it's like yeah can you please chop this like, can we now have my surgery and then she's like can I now have my surgery to cut on my vulva mm, and clitoris to make it look more like a penis and testicles mm, you know of course will never be a penis and testicles ever mm, no matter what is cut mm, or attached to it mm, yeah, mm. I waste time mm, continue on uh, let's go. And then she says, in order to transition, I feel like you know everything about me. Probe me. Ensure that I am trans enough. Mm -hmm. I'm like, what? Mm -hmm. Who cares? Uh, for them. It was. It still crops up now and then as well. Like how I can't really look forward to change my name or gender legally. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't be doing that anyway. Mm -hmm. you know, I'm wrong with the name or gender you can't have. Mm -hmm. You may not like it, but please. Mm -hmm. you know? Just work on that. Mm -hmm. well, they also nicknames are for mm -hmm. you know. You know, it's like, you don't like Lois? Why not Lou? <laughs> you, know, you don't like uh, Charlene? What about Lee? <laughs> Come on. Don't you? you know, or something. Mm, yeah. It's so bad. Mm. There's so many things you could do mm. that involve changing, you know, basically keeping your normal name, but using a, a nickname mm -hmm. or something else that's more of your personality, you know. Basically, look, keep me like, oh, go, of course, not like my wild actual sex, but being like, yeah, mm, mm, yeah. I like when people are like, go from groups to individual. I'm like, okay, that, that girl there, I don't like this. Mm, that dude there likes that. Mm, you know, mm, doesn't, you know, don't like this or something like that. That makes more sense. Oh, the, she's one of those people, mm, you know. Uh, or he's one of those people and wants to like this stuff over here right now. Mm, that's not true. Mm, that's stereotypes. It's prejudice. Mm, right? Not cool. Good thing on here. Uh, this for you has nothing to compare to the little things come from what people will wish they had. What? Mm. Sure, I wish I was a few inches taller. Mm. Uh, yeah, mm. sure, whatever. Maybe that's I, I had a bit of darker hair or fewer eyelashes. My fingernails grew shorter, slower. Yeah, yeah, who cares? Uh, but that doesn't haunt me. Follow me around. It doesn't cause enough pain that I actually feel like I need to change. Mm. Uh, that's terrible. You feel pain. Yeah, you need to learn. You need to learn that that pain is wrong. Mm, something's wrong. With that that pain is wrong. That pain is leading you a bad direction. Mm, you know, you know, but yeah, I still don't like that aspect of myself. Mm, yeah, I gotta learn to accept that aspect. Mm, you don't like it. You want to know And you're right about not being able to change. No one can. No, not only can I not make myself a comfortable in skin woman. Uh, okay, no one is truly comfortable in skin. Mm, that's another pillar. No one is truly fully comfortable in skin. Mm, we all have to learn to be. Mm, yeah. I can't make myself a comfortable in skin man. Oh, no. yeah, yeah, she'll never be a man. She'll go with over reason. Well, then we're not gonna have it. either. And in ways I don't want to. Being trans is part of who I am. No, it's not. Mm, no, it's not. Mm, it's a uh, temptation to sin. Mm, you gotta say no to it. Mm, like any other sin. Mm, okay, no, no. And I can't erase that and stay the same person. Yes, you can. Mm, you say, uh, no. Mm, I refuse. Mm, I do it all the time. I say, no, I don't need really to temptation. Uh, to see it comes out, I'm like, no, no, I know what this is. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> that's not happening. <laughs> yeah. 
We're going to do things the right way. We're going to follow the ways of God. We're going to, you know, like it says in the Bible, you know, so, yeah. You know, there I go. So why change? Because it's what someone else told me I have to do. Because when you're going down a bad path, you know, when someone says, yeah, that, that leads to a cliff, hmm, you should probably listen to their advice or you'll fall off the cliff, <laughs> you know? So it's like, what the, it's like, you know, it's like, oh, no, man, please. It's like, there is really a cliff, <laughs> you know? But then it's like, turn right around, be like, oh, a moment of silence where everyone is falling off the cliff. <laughs> the poor cliff. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Why do they keep doing it? Why does this keep happening? If only this stop would stop happening. Why, oh, excuse me, I'm going to get off the path. Like, no. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, continue on. Oh, God. Yeah, we're good. Uh, why I change? Because that's what else, oh, because of what someone else wants to do. I say, you'll never be trans enough, so you should not try. Also, the word man is a social term. That means male. Anyone? Yeah, I say a little for her, 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 her gender, her uh, uh, preferred pronouns. She said, I, she said that, oh, uh, well, I said that's not necessary. Culture, really culture. She said that's not necessary. Like, she says that, oh, uh, I, I don't, I want to use male, him, he, him pronouns, male pronouns, you know, man pronouns. I was like, and I'm like, oh, they are not, I say, because they are necessary. Why was wrong not using those? I was like, she's because they're not necessary. Your birth pronouns are good enough. Your job is to prove that the stereotype about them are wrong. Mm -hmm. And it's like, it's like, no, they're really not. I mean, yeah, they're, mm -hmm, yeah. they're not good in the slightest. Mm -hmm. Why? Why? Mm -hmm. Because of what you believe they need. Mm -hmm. You think that uh, she and her pronouns for someone born with ovaries, uh, you, it means weak, mm -hmm. yeah, inferior, mm -hmm. yeah. Then you gotta stop thinking that. Mm -hmm. You gotta realize that doesn't mean that. It means born with ovaries. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, so, let's continue on here. She says, uh, and I, was like, I tried like, to be myself and still be a girl. There we have a problem. So basically, she's saying, I try to be myself but still be a girl. So, a stereotype about how girls act. Mm, because uh, you're born with ovaries, uh, you know, basically that means you were born with ovaries. Uh, uterus, uh, vagina, and a vulva. Mm -mm, that was a girl. Mm -mm, you know, basically, when uh, you were, you know, basically came out your mom. Mm -mm, okay, yeah. came out your mom's vulva mm -mm, because that's how well, babies are born, uh, or were cut out because mm -mm, yeah, basically, or were cut out whichever way. But when you came out your mom, uh, they looked at what reproductive organs you had. Mm -mm, it's like, okay, this one has a penis. That's cool. That's a boy. Mm -mm, you know. Because that's a vulva, it's a girl, mm -hmm. you know, because that's what it is. Mm -hmm. That's male, that's female. Mm -hmm. you know, testicles are male, ovaries are female. Mm -hmm. you know, external genitalia, te you know, penis, testicles, that's male. Vulva is female, because including clitoris is female, because that's how it is. Mm -hmm. You know, that system right there. Basically, what that system is, like what the uh, external genitalia shows are what everything is connected to. Mm -hmm. Okay, when you see a penis and testicles, Obviously, that's male. Mm -hmm. That's a male because basically uh, the penis, you know, the sperm, the testicles are generated by the sperm and the penis is designed to deliver it into a vulva. Mm -hmm. Okay. Into a vagina. <laughs> it's what it's designed for. Mm -hmm. You know, the uh, vulva oh, and clitoris are a sign that this person is a female because that means they have a vagina. Mm -hmm. Okay. The vulva goes, you know, you know, leads to the vagina. Vagina is where the penis needs to go to put sperm in there. Mm -hmm. So then that'll swim up in through past the uterus into the fallopian tubes where an egg where the ovaries are. What we do is we connect to the ovaries and they have there's an egg the, from the ovaries that comes down the fallopian tube and they meet up and that'll be fertilized, there'll be a new the new baby in there, new life, new baby going in there and then that will go plant on the, you know, everything goes like according to plan. It will plant on the side on one of the walls of the uterus, grow to a full grown full you know you know, basically, term baby, and then get pushed out that vulva, <laughs> or cut out, <laughs> the way, you know, that's basically, the vulva shows off what the, you know, reproductive style that is, that's basically what the vulva does, you know, is it the type that well, gives or receives, <laughs> basically, you know, so, I'm sorry, when someone says, no, uh, I'm trying to be a girl, I'm like, you don't have to try, <laughs> Do you have a vulva? <laughs> like, uh, yeah, look at your girl. <laughs> uh, like, mm, yeah, done. Done. You have an ovary? You were born with ovaries? <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> you have a vulva? <laughs> yeah. 
No, I'm talking about born with one, not not a bigger manufactured one. Mm. So, oh my god, mm. you get a manufactured vulva for a penis and testicles. It ain't a vulva. Mm. It's uh, remains of penis and testicles. <laughs> <laughs> no thanks mm. yeah. so I'm like yeah when someone says they're trying to be something you know, biology it, it basically means they're being a stereotype of that biology mm. 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 good one mm. good one let's write that down mm. when someone yeah crap this, 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 thing, this is not good Wait, one says they are Trying to be a biology, then they mean they are. It's a little long, but that's okay. Mm. To be a stereotype. Of that biology. Mm. Again, you don't have to try to be a, a girl. Mm. If you were born with female reproductive organs, then you're a girl. Mm. Done. Mm. Born with male reproductive organs, you're a boy. Mm. Done. But yeah, again, you know, trying to be a girl or trying to be a boy, uh, stereotypes of one. Mm. Uh, yeah, with especially if you were born with the uh, opposite uh, reproductive organs. Is a lie. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's a lie. That's what it is. Continue on here. I've tried tomboy, which is based a stereotype of a, which is a stereotype. But here's the deal: with tomboy is a girl who uh, usually is a girl. Yeah, the other days they have girls because they're basically making fun of them. Mm -hmm. Making fun of these girls who are not trying to wear dresses and trying to act like boys. Mm -hmm. You know, that's tomboy. Mm -hmm. You know, tomboys. They get their hair cut short. They try. They they hang out. Try to you know, hang out with the boys. Uh, and you know, basically wear the same clothes, similar as the clothes as they can, clothes to theirs, you know, and try to act like they're all tough, like like a boy acts. That can be a bit of an issue, but it can also not be. They also be just normal. What's going on? Oh wow! Okay, see, see, I'm new to be an architect.